loves, my name is Sheree and welcome to my beauty, fashion, and lifestyle channel. Spring has finally sprung and I think it's time for spring makeup. I'm thinking yellow, like the sun. <laughs> Today I'm going to be doing a yellow eye makeup look. First, let's just put on our base, like our foundation, our concealer, and all that jazz, and then we'll get straight into the eye makeup. Give me a second, just one second. you know you're not eating properly yeah i know uh-huh talk to you later you're gonna be in my video talking what you're gonna be in my video yapping i can't hear you i said you are going to be in my video yapping oh, i don't want to be in your video well you are why because i'm recording oh so why you put me in the video i thought i hung up you <laughs> a clown I cannot <laughs> talk to you later let me get out this video <laughs> to work on these eyes the first thing I like to do is put down a base this is going to stop creasing of the eyeshadow but it's also going to bring out the pigment in the yellow shade that I will be using I will put a link to all of the products that I'm using down in the description box so you can check those items out if you would like I like to work on a dry surface, so I'm going to set the eyeshadow base with translucent setting powder. I am using BH Cosmetics Take Me to Brazil palette. It is filled with beautiful colors. So right now I'm going into the yellow and I'm going to just start dusting that all in my crease and all over the eyelid. I want a full yellow eye look. When working with a shade like yellow, it's really important to just take your time and try not to add too much product at once because it can get cakey really fast. So just take your time. As soon as you see that yellow getting really choppy and cakey, Stop what you're doing immediately. <laughs> so now I'm going to take a darker yellow shade and start tapping that into my outer crease or my outer V. And now I'm going to start packing yellow onto my eyelid. So now I'm going to move on to my lower lash line. I'm going to start by applying a brown eyeliner in my waterline. I'm using brown because black is a harder color and I want the eye look to be a little bit more on the softer side. So that's why I'm using brown. And of course, I want the yellow eyeshadow to stand out. So I'm going to put down a little bit of a white base on my lower lash line. It looks crazy right now, but you definitely have to trust the process. <laughs> okay, so now I'm going to start packing some yellow on top of that white shade. It's standing out a little bit too much for my liking, so I think I'm going to take, hmm, maybe a nice orange shade to kind of like blend that yellow out a little bit. We are yellow. Oh gosh, now that that orange is in there, I almost feel like I gotta add a little bit of orange to the outer V. That was definitely not my plan, but this is where we're at. So I'm just gonna add a little bit of orange on the outer portion of the eye. I feel like spring. 
This is clearly undone. We have to finish this look off. We need some mascara. We need some lashes, some blush, some lip gloss. And I'll be right back to show you the final results. They say true love is the greatest weapon. Oh my gosh. So here is the final look. Ah, it's yellow. <laughs> I am really feeling this yellow. It is a lot of work to get yellow eyeshadow on your eyelids, but I think it looks really cute. I've actually done a yellow look in the past. It was a little different, slightly different, so I will link that video up in the cards above so you can check that one out as well. If you're interested in seeing more spring makeup looks, just give me a thumbs up. Also, come back on Friday for another video from me. Bye! Peace.